In the last video, we learned how to install Drupal for the first time. In this video, we'll visit our website page for the first time. So let's do that. Just go to browser and type localhost slash your website name. So let's do it. Here you can see I have typed the website name localhost slash my demo website. So this is the first page of our website. Here you can see the header and the text demo website. We can change it easily. This is the image. We can obviously change the header settings, which we will see in the upcoming videos. Here you can see the default page home is visible. On the left sidebar, you can see the search option is visible. You can add many options here. Also from the section blocks and region, which we will discuss in the upcoming videos. Here you can see the login option is visible. Here I'll log into my admin. If you are not having any account, you just have to create a new account from here. And if, if you forget your password, you can change it from here. Here you can see you can create new account. All the options are visible. We are having our admin account right now. So no worries for us. On the bottom, you can see the footer section is visible. By default, Drupal provides a contact form option. Click on it. Here you can see the default website feedback form is visible. So you, there is no need to add a new one. Here you can see in the bottom, the copyright options are visible. That is powered by Drupal. You can easily change it afterwards. So in this video, we learn how to visit our website page for the first time. In the next video, we will learn how to log into our website for the first time as an admin. Thank you for watching.